from a million comedians, even ones that are now big. Like I remember one time I was doing a show out this way and it was me, Willie Barcena, um, a bunch of people. And Carlos came in at the end, I was the headliner. And all of a sudden Willie goes, hey Dante, um, Carlos is here, wrap it up. So he comes up, he's sort of a star at the time. And uh, he gets up there, his first joke, they boo him. Mm. And he goes, what? And he goes, they go, Willie told that joke already. And Willie's like, yeah, that's my joke, bro. Oh, <laughs> and, yeah. And Carlos goes, hey man, I'm more famous. I'm gonna use it on TV. I'm gonna take it, okay, Willie? And Willie, because he's famous. You know what I mean? So He was the most famous at the time. And Willie went, yeah, okay. But it was sort of like he was held at gunpoint. The whole audience is watching. Is he gonna say no fuck you? You know what I mean? Is this around the time of Mind and Mencia? Or is that before? Prior, prior to that? Prior. He had been stealing forever. So what Joe Rogan did to him wasn't uncalled for. He had been he had been doing we, that. I've known he was a, a thief since I met him when I was about 17. Wow. Yeah, he stole jokes from my friends. He would come down to San Diego, the La Jolla Comedy Store, before I moved up here. And he would take from a guy named Johnny Rosas. He would take from um, Frank Manzano, a whole bunch of guys. Do you like, think all that's, the Hispanic comics. Is that due to a lack of creative vision? He says, his excuse, did you ever see what he said? I've seen a few videos, but... His one video is like, hey, yeah, I steal. That's right, I'm like a rapper. I sample. If you say something and I think it's funny, it's going in the act. That's exactly, like, I, I'm misrepresenting yeah, the words, I, but I that's exactly I the sentiment.